Welcome to Mel Monday's episode 116. The Queen has returned. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> did you enjoy your week off? I did actually. <laughs> Although I missed some cool stuff. Yeah. Keyboards and stuff were dope. They really were. They're very pretty when they light up too. We have, uh, I think 12 items here today because three showed up and we only needed one more to be at 10 to make this episode, but then three showed up. So uh, click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life, handleclothing.com for the merch. Let's open up our packages for Mel Monday's episode 116. That means we're 16 weeks into 2024. That's weird yeah. to think of it like that. Yeah. This year is, I just can't. <laughs> You got, looks like it's about half and half, so. Yeah. Did you check, you did check the mailbox, right? I did not check the mailbox, so if there's okay. something in the mailbox, it'll be Mail Mondays 117. Next week. <laughs> I'll start with this one, I guess. The only black packaging. I know. I figured it's for me. And. Ooh, I might know what this is. This is a solar panel. I do think I know what this is. Doesn't save for what, but solar panel. Yeah. If I'm. If I'm not mistaken, uh, that is the solar panel for the Google Nest battery camera that uh, I've wanted a solar panel forever for. And they were gonna send me one. I was curious if it said anything. Yeah, it doesn't say anything. Well, maybe it's part of something else. It could be, it could be, but like I'm thinking one. it's that. Okay. All right. Good start. Uh, I gotta sneeze. Okay. I'm gonna go with this one because I feel like this one, yeah, this one was, I think this one over here is the heaviest, but either way. There we go. The subcase knife. Our friends. Ooh. Ooh You'll be excited for this one. I will. Yeah. I like the package. This is ah, something that we've made some videos on before. This one's different because this is a smart hummingbird feeder, not just a smart bird feeder. So this one's made specifically for hummingbirds, has a camera, of course, and uh, you put your, you know, sugar water in or whatever, and boom, you can record the hummingbirds that come up to you. I am so excited for that. I knew she would like this one. We have two hummingbird feeders already, and I just, <laughs> I love watching them. They're right in my window. <laughs> so smart hummingbird feeder. Oh, that is dope. I thought you I don't that. know where we'll put it, but we're going to find a place. <laughs> Um, do you want me to give my two for? If you want to. I want to. These look to be... Maybe not. These look to be completely identical. So that's why we're opening them together. The two for, if you will. And let's see if it's easy to open. Wedge my finger in there. And uno numero, or numero uno. Oh. Eye serum. I do remember these. Okay. So they are the same, but one slightly different than the other. 5% caffeine, 360 roller, anti-aging, deep puffing. So it goes for under yeah. your eyes. Oh my and God. It's, and it's in like a roller. So it's, it's just like rolls right on your eyes from how it looks. So they are the same, but a little different? They are the same. I can't remember what the difference is in both of them, but they're both essentially for your eyes. And oh my gosh. Trying to keep me looking young. I thought you would like them, honestly, so that's why when they reached out, I was like, yeah, sure, I'm gonna do it for you. I was told I was early 20s or someone else said 28. And I was like, I'll take either. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's, yeah. So this one is retinol eye serum for dark circles, puffiness, and wrinkles. So very similar dark yeah. circles stuff. For your eyes, yeah. Mm. And like Party. I said, from the look of it, it literally had like a ball. And so you was literally able to just like roll it around your eyes. It yeah. looked very easy. Oh, I'm yeah. excited. Sweet. Well, let's, uh, I'm going to go with the little one. You'll have to do this. Uh, I don't think I know what this is. I'll oh, make it in the box. This is... I did one before and didn't really get a general idea of what it would actually be used for. But this one actually works a lot better, I think. This is a rechargeable light bulb but this rechargeable light bulb doesn't have to be plugged into charge it'll charge based off of the little e26 base so what that means is this light bulb would be ready and charged up in the event of a power outage which that's what i really liked and wanted to display and make a video on so basically you'd be able to have it in your light socket use it every day and then your power goes out you'd still be able to use the lights that these are because they have the battery in it to run that's cool yeah, I thought it was pretty dope, so. Rechargeable light bulbs. I like these. These are all so flat. No. I don't know what they are. I don't think there's any cases coming. 
<laughs> you lied to me. I know what that is. Nope. Laptop docking station. Oh, okay. Don't really remember that, but okay. <laughs> no brand name, no nothing on it. I hate nope. when they come like that. Huh. All right, laptop docking station. <laughs> uh, let's go with this one. Okay. Has my address on it, but I do not recall. Oh, it's a new game. This was not supposed to be sent to me. I didn't even get an email on this. Do you but like it trouble? Totally has my address right there. So yeah, this is a uh, Disney trouble. Yeah, Disney Junior Mini Trouble Game. I absolutely did not get an email on this. I absolutely did not approve this. It does have my address on it, so it was sent to the right place, but we didn't buy it and nobody reached out. So either some other person that I worked with before just threw it in the mail and shipped it to me, or I don't know. It even has a little welcome to the castle thing for your door. Aww. Yeah. All right. That's Disney cool. Trouble Game. <laughs> it has stickers and everything. That's a nice gift for a little one. That's fine. I saw that one. Like, this is not a... Uh, I shouldn't have this. <laughs> this sounds brick. And, uh, hopefully not. And, da -da. Portable door lock. Oh, okay. So this is for uh, like a hotel. And you can literally like stick it into the hotel door and somehow of another you wouldn't be able to open the hotel door with that uh, portable door lock in there. So, mm -hmm. pretty cool. Yeah. Keeps you safe. Yeah. Er. All right. Let's see if this one is something that we actually got reached out to. <laughs> this one's going to be sorry. For Monopoly. For just a box. So this is... Yes, a box. Just a box. <laughs> it is... Uh, oh! We've been waiting on this one. We have ladder shelf for blankets. That does not look like it would be able to have a lot of weight. This box is very teeny. Well basically that was a spider. Where? Right here that I killed. Oh thank you. Yeah. But basically it's a shelf. It's one shelf and then the shelf has like a rope ladder that you can hang four or five oh, uh, blankets rope. on. Okay. Yeah. That'd be cute. It's just a little rope ladder, but the very top part's a shelf that you could technically put stuff on. Okay. So, but yeah, there we go. Rope ladder for uh, blankets. Now it's parking time. You're next, Mike Wayne. Okay. Brainstorming. <laughs> All right, what is this one? The brown box. Aw. Let's see. Identity protection roller stamps. We already got that. Yeah, you did say that. I've already made the whole video and everything. And that's the exact same packaging. Okay, well. We got two identity protection roller stamps things. Well, darn, that, that stinks. Yeah, what do you do? All right. Next. This is the heaviest box that we got, and I don't know what it is. Something for me. Hopefully. <laughs> it's too small to be a sofa. <laughs> If you like our channel and you want to help out, I am done for a new sofa. And then now we'll get rid of the dog, that way it wouldn't get destroyed. It'll be a win-win for everybody. Does that have to keep them all the living room? Or keep them off the furniture? Um, well this looks interesting. What do we got here? Oh. Another one. Well that's awesome. Heck yeah. I knew this was coming, but then like I never heard back from them, so I kind of didn't think it was coming. But... Do it. A Mars 01 robot vacuum cleaner. This one uh, is pretty nice. I feel like it had, uh, it doesn't say, I don't think. But I believe it had LiDAR, which is kind of like the Wise smart vacuum had, where like basically it can kind of see a little better and knows how to go around things. But uh, yeah, a robot, smart robot vacuum. Sweet, that's awesome. Really didn't know that was coming. They, I don't think they ever emailed me back that they were actually shipping it. I was like, yeah, I'll make a video and then just never heard anything. It'll be better than our current one because the current one you can't seem to do through the app very well. Like it never worked right. The set a schedule and stuff like that. Yeah, it had the schedule, but it would always be off. So like we'd tell it to run every day at 5 a.m. and it would might run at 2 a.m. It might run at 9 a.m. It just kind of ran whatever it wanted to. All right. Fuzzies. My last one. Oh. I hate when it's an even number. Well, it would have been uneven if it would open the other one separately. That's true. <laughs> well, those are for me, so it kind of worked out. And this one is... 
A swim cap? Unisex adult swim cap. Yep. I remember, I remember that. that brand. Yeah, that's all, that's the only reason I knew it. I remember they reached out, they have a just a swim cap. You know, she'll model it because she's a model. So. Not everyone can pull off not having hair and I look pretty rough without the hair. All right, last one. This one just arrived today. No earthly idea what this is. Pretty big box here. We've got a little tear here, so we'll just kind of keep it going. Ooh, we got two for it, it looks like. Oh, okay. What is it? Damn it. All right, so this is something I was looking forward to. And it looks like they did send us two. They are king, they're white, but these are, uh, is it upside down? Okay, let's write it this way. Sydney Sleep. They make memory foam pillows. This is like the couple's set, I believe. So I think these were $150 for the set of two pillows, if I'm not mistaken. They're $79 or so a piece, give or take. But yeah, adjustable memory foam pillows. These are king size. Super excited to try these. And I asked for two so that way my queen could try one and I could try one. And we'll see uh, what we think of these Sydney Sleep pillows. Yeah. I'm excited. Yeah, I see it has like the... Yeah, yeah, the, the arch. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's like... Or it's come toward like to that. your shoulders or your neck, I guess. I don't know. Cool. Pretty dope. Heck yeah. All right. Well, let's line up all this stuff up on the table. So... This is everything for Mail Monday's episode 116. Um, a bunch of these I think will actually be making their way to the main YouTube, which is good for me. Uh, the pillows, I agreed to make a YouTube on, so I'm going to make a YouTube for that. Smart Hummingbird Feeder, Rechargeable Lights, definitely the vacuum. Uh, and actually this solar panel, which again I'm pretty certain is for the uh, Nest. Google Nest battery camera. So, uh, and this item I'll probably make a video on even though it wasn't supposed to be sent to me. And I don't know why we got it, but it had my address and my name. So it, it wasn't like the wrong thing was delivered here. Just wasn't supposed to get it. <laughs> so we'll see you in the next Mail Mondays. Click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. We'll see you next time. Deuces. Bye. Welcome back, my queen. Thank you. <laughs>